So, so it was right before 1030. So, I mean, I guess I looked at the clock and it said 1026. Okay. And I'm thinking it's basically 1030. Okay. And you didn't call anybody else in that time frame between waking him up and calling 911? The only, I call, I, uh, I, while I was doing the CPR, I called um, Miss Brenda and I just said, 911, please come. Okay. Um, now you called her? I call, yeah, while I was doing the CPR. Okay. Is I that just, on your phone too? No, um, I, didn't, I didn't see that on there. No, the only person who helped with CPR was the 911 dispatcher. Okay. But you, you, text, you text Emma and you text Brenda Michael. I, yeah, but Brenda's didn't go through. So I just text Emma. Okay. Did you text, did you text or call anyone else between 1021 and 1031? No. Okay. It would be on here. Okay. Specifically that I knew that Emma was at the house before the paramedics were. Okay. You told me you didn't t text her till afterwards. Okay, you're saying you don't remember. I get it that there's some, some excited stuff going on. I understand that. But I find it strikingly suspicious that you show up today with the time you called 911 with the with the phone number with the phone numbers on the call log of the other parents you called deleted. I am highly suspicious of that. Especially when you you did not delete the 911 call or Brody's parents or Brody's parents. And it's like like to the parents. And then what I didn't realize was how long it had been. I didn't realize it had been the 10 or 12 minutes. So when I realized, I'm thinking, oh, sh I had no idea it had been 10 to 12 mm -hmm. minutes. So, that, of when, course. Yeah, so I'm like, oh, my God. Is that when you decided yes. to delete them? Yes, I did. Okay. And that—that that is what I lied about.